Today we'll be having a look at the Kurt ball mount for two inch ATB hitches with an inch and seven eighths ball and a clevis bar. Part number C45005. Here's what our ball mount looks like installed. Now the main reason you're gonna want a ball mount like this is because not only do you get the ball mount, you also get a clevis pin and a clevis hole, giving you the versatility to tow with three different options. Let's show you how you can do that without having to swap out your ball mount for a different style of ball mount. The ball on our ball mount allows us to easily hook up to a trailer And now we'll drive around with our trailer and show you what it's like. We can also use the same ball mount to tow a utility spreader such as this one using the clevis hole. To use the clevis hole, you just slide your device over the ball mount, take your pin, drop it down through the holes, and secure it with your clip. A lot of our customers have been impressed with how well constructed the ball mount is, they enjoy how well it fits into the receiver on their ATV. It's a nice and solid fit. The ball mount is coated in a nice powder coat finish, which is rust and corrosion resistant. So it'll last you a very long time without having to worry about it rusting away. Here's what our ball mount comes with. We have our ball mount and the included pin and clip to secure it to our ATV hitch. This ball mount has a carrying capacity greater than any ATV hitch out there on the market, so make sure you don't exceed the capacities of your ATV hitch when you're towing a trailer or using this for any ATV accessories. We'll get a few measurements of our ball mount here real quick. From the end of our shank to the center of our 5 8 of an inch diameter hitch pin hole, we're looking at about two and a half inches. From the center of our hitch pin hole to the center of our ball, we're looking at about six inches from the center of the hitch pin hole to the center of the 5 8 of an inch diameter clevis hole. We're looking at about seven and a half inches. Overall, we're looking at a quarter inch rise on our platform to our ball mount. Now that we've got over some features, we'll show you how to get it installed. We'll take our ball mount and we'll slide it into the hitch of our ATV. Once we have ensured that the hole of the ball mount lines up with the hole of the hitch, We'll insert our pin and we'll clip the pin into place. And that completes your look at the Kurt ball mount for two inch ATV hitches with an inch and seven eighths ball and a clevis bar. Part number C45005.